Hi. Hey, how you doing? Good. Kristen's here after a six-month recovery from a serious car accident. I'm looking to get a star on the back of my neck with a halo over it and soft angel wings. And I want, like, a light blue shade on the outer edges of the wings. I survived an accident in December. My tattoo will symbolize guidance, healing, and hope. I need a lot of hope right now so that I can continue healing. So what were you thinking about doing it? On, on the, the back, back of your neck? neck. Uh -huh. Cool. I was in a coma for the first few days. I had head trauma, three skull fractures, two broken ribs, seven pelvic breaks. I had so many broken bones that they didn't know that I was going to make it. Put like a halo above the star? Yeah. Maybe just a little burst of light or something coming up here. Like real light, just to give the wings some uh, depth. All right, I didn't think know? about that. As Kristen told me what she wanted, I basically did a little full-size thumbnail. And then I usually take something like that and I'll refine it, make it a little crisper, a little more symmetrical. Give me a few minutes and I'll draw it up and I'll have you check it out again. OK, okay. thank you. Bye. Kristen's back to see her angel wings. Wow. Yeah, I like that a lot. Maybe we could do like a little red and orange mix, and then a little bit of blue in these tips. I like it. I am here because I was in an accident in December, and I put together a tattoo. It's going to symbolize what I want out of my life and the things that I'm looking for. Take a look at that. I like it a lot. Cool. Looks good, huh? Uh huh. OK, Kristen, here goes. What's the whole meaning of this uh, tattoo, anyway? I was in an accident about six months ago. It was the first hard rain our town had. And I was getting on the freeway. And my tires lost ta traction with the road. And I hit the center divider and bounced out sideways into the middle of the freeway. I was at a dead stop. And a semi-truck T-boned me going between 55 and 60 miles per hour. The driver's side door was smashed all the way into the center console and there, my body was in that spot, I guess. I don't remember December or January because it knocked out those two months from my memory, I Do guess. Do you still don't remember? No, nothing. I was basically like a little kid. I didn't know who everybody was. My mom kept telling me she was my mother and I didn't believe her. Who was there to be your support? Um, a lot of friends were there. My grandparents were there. I had a lot of family support, but one of the best people there was my friend Corey. Corey? Yeah. Hey, that's me. Yeah, that's how I remember your name. <laughs> he was there taking care of me at the hospital. And really, I believe if it wasn't for him, I wouldn't have made it through with therapy. And I don't think I would have had the strength to be where I am today. He helped me through so much. People have all kinds of reasons for tattoos. She had a great one. To think that she went through that type of devastation and get tattooed six months later, it kind of blows me away. I honestly feel like somebody was in the vehicle with me that night. Going by how I was pinned in and how they said that they found me, I shouldn't be here. Is that what the angel wings are for? Yes. Really? Mm -hmm. Well, I bet your uh, guardian angel would approve of the tattoo, I'm hoping. All right, now you get to check it out. Oh, my god. I like it a lot. You see it good? Oh yeah. I like the wings, too. They're awesome. Thank you so much. You're very welcome. You've earned it. Thank you. No matter what bad days I have now, it can't be as bad as what I've already been through. And I'm thankful for that. Just having the tattoo on me, I will always look back and realize I've made it. I've come this far. I can keep doing better.